Pew, hello. You guys, it's so exciting. I can actually see the stream on Twitch. So usually, <laughs> hey PQ, usually when I'm on StreamYards, I can't see anything, but I'm signed in in a way that I could see Twitch and this is amazing. Hi you guys, hello Neko, good to see you. So we just covered Foodie Beauty's TikTok live stream over on YouTube. And as soon as we were wrapping it up, we saw that Foodie Beauty uploaded a new video. She was making elotes at 5 a.m. 5 a.m. Like usually at 5 a.m. all I'm thinking about is I have to pee and I want a drink of water. But Foodie Beauty <laughs> filmed an entire thing. So we're going to watch that. But first, hi, Lisa. Hello, Groovy. Hello, Jez. First, we're going to look at a few tweets from Foodie Beauty Twitter. We're going to see what they're saying before we watch it. So hi, by the way, and thank you so much for hanging out with me. I appreciate it. So hopefully you guys can see. Yes. Okay, you can. This is so cool. I love that I can finally see what happens on Twitch. It's it's like so much more aesthetically pleasing than YouTube. I love looking at it. <laughs> hey, Satan, good to see you. Hold on one second. Okay, so if you guys can't see, I highly suggest you zoom in. I know you can on an iPhone and iPad. Okay. So we're just going to read what people are talking about as far as her new video goes. Bra said, the Abaya sleeve caressing the mayo slathered corn. Oh my gosh. Fondu Pondu said, who the hell gets up at 5 a.m. to make elotes? She is heavy breathing like she ran a marathon and smearing her seated fingers up and down the corn. What a fulfilling life to live. Yeah. <laughs> sorry, not sorry said. How did they go through all those groceries when they've been eating out all but three times? She had to be eating round the clock, or they gave his family some of that food. She's an expensive one to keep around. It's like feeding a hippo. <laughs> it is like feeding a hippo. Oh my gosh. Okay, prettier than 90% or 99% of Girl World said, where the F is the spice? Also, good God, her breathing is terrifying. Hey, Vicky. Did I miss anybody? Good to see you guys. Okay, let's see. And then somebody said, oh my God, the gasping. Look at her. Look at her. I have no words. None. I'm just going to pretend that didn't happen. And <laughs> punch me in the face said the beatus. That's foodie. Okay. Oh, and we we saw these ones earlier. Okay. So we did cover a lot of what Foodie Beauty put us saying over on the YouTube live stream, but I just wanted you guys to see this. This is absolutely terrifying to me. Those are my words. I'm scared. Hey, Allegro. Hey, everybody. I am scared of this. I feel like you could put this cut out on the porch for Halloween and like you'd have the scariest house in town. <laughs> It's just scary. It's scary. And that thing used to be loose on her. I'm not even trying to be mean. Hey, seven lives. Yeah, we're going to be on a lot. We're going to be live a lot and doing videos a lot today. At some point, I think I have a doctor's appointment at six. But um, I'm, if Foodie Beauty goes live on TikTok or whatever, I'm going to try to go live on YouTube. Um, but if I can't at the same time, I'm just going to screen record it and then we'll cover it later. But yeah, we're going to be live a lot today, it seems like. <laughs> Mandy said, this is her Halloween costume, Angry Muslim Revert. It's terrifying. And then I just remember, I remember in, I actually have a short, I think, of her wearing this. And she was doing some kind of like fake parkour at McDonald's, <laughs> like hopping around. And this used to be like loose on her. It's crazy. It's just crazy to see how much she's gaining because of her choices. But she thinks that she's prettier than 99% of YouTube and that she's healthy and fine and you can eat what you want and lose weight and still be fine. Neko said, between this and that red and white checkered shirt, you can really see the You can. It's shocking. Hey, you guys. Thanks again for hanging out with me. I really appreciate it. Thanks for joining me here. Okay, are we ready to get into her video? Which, by the way, she has a new Halloween intro, and I thought she wasn't allowed to celebrate Halloween. 
Just thought I would point that out. She looks like Igor. Oh my gosh, Lisa. Why though? She does. She does. Okay, Hello. I didn't realize I had my headphones plugged in this whole time. So Hello, Beezers. Oh. So hopefully you could hear me that whole time. Sorry. Hopefully you guys could hear me okay. Did you know you can now request a personalized video from me on Cameo that you can keep forever and ever? I know. We all know now and nobody wants them. So can we move on from this? Thank you. Cameos make great birthday and... Yeah, if you hate the person. Check the link in the description. From you. Not a chance in hell. Oh, jeez. Oh. My. Gosh. This is a sight to see. Oh, my gosh. It's so creepy how she's entering the room, too. Like, what is going on? I have no words, and yet I have to watch this again. I guess, you know, it's 5 a.m. I'm a little crazy at 5 a.m., too, though, but truthfully, <laughs> this is creepy. <laughs> Are we sneaking into the kitchen? What is this? Well, hello guys. Welcome back to my kitchen. I'm pretty hungry. I was laying in bed. It's like five in the morning and I haven't been able to sleep. And I was thinking, you know, when you're thinking, are we at a haunted house? Mandy, I think we are. Happy Halloween, everybody. <laughs> oh my gosh. I have to watch it again. I have to. I have to. Well, hello guys. Welcome back to my kitchen. I'm pretty hungry. I was. Why? Well, hello guys. Welcome back to my kitchen. I'm pretty hungry. I was laying in bed. It's like five in the morning, and I haven't been able to sleep. Lindsay, I don't know why she did that. I don't know if we were sneaking into the kitchen. If we, I'm like, what was that? <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh no, Jess. Okay. Hi, Anna. Oh my gosh. Okay. And I was thinking, yeah. somebody needs to make that their intro. When you're thinking of like, you're hungry, so you're thinking of combinations of things you have in your kitchen. Well, the only thing I have, we have to do groceries today, later today. I have some frozen corn and I thought, you know what? I'm going to try to make a lotus. So, yellow, let's go. All right, so it's frozen, but whatever. Okay, hey, Vicky. Okay, hold on really fast. I happen to love elotes. I'm not sure if I say it even right, but I love it. I absolutely love it. So if you guys don't know what that is, it's grilled corn on the cob, and it's kind of like flathered in mayo, cream sauce, not kind of, it is a lot of it. And it has chili powder, cheese, lime. It's so good. It's so good. Like, my mouth is watering thinking about it. What she is going to make, <laughs> and, like, look it up. Google a pic. Go search an image of it. And just picture it as, like, the best party in your mouth ever. It just tastes so good. What she makes is not going to be it, okay? So first thing I'm going to do is fill a pot with uh, with hot water. And I'm telling you, you guys, you will love it. Just all the flavors. I can't even describe, but it just does something. They all work so well together. And I'm telling you, my mouth is watering thinking of it. If you have the opportunity to try it, please do. Please do. I should run it underwater, shouldn't I? Yeah, that made it easier. So I have the corn on the cobs here. The corn cobs. Ooh. Four. Two for me, two for Salah. They're really good, but they're typically like huge and you don't really need two. You really don't. So we're gonna need some mayo. Some parm because I don't have cotija cheese. Pickles to snack on now. 
And a huge thing of to snack on now. Butter. <sighs> oh, yeah. Want a pickle? Not after you touched it. <laughs> Yeah, we have to do groceries because. First of all, you have a penis chin right now. Second of all, those filters, I don't even know. It's not. Do you guys see her chin? And uh, I can't get past it. I lost my train of thought. Oh, and why do you need groceries again? I feel like you did a huge grocery haul. And then I know you've put in several grocery orders. So why do you need more groceries? I got to get back to cooking. We don't have very much here now. All right, check it out. Where did all your, you ate all that food? You had so much food. And of course, all that's left is water. <laughs> hey, big smile. Hey, Steffi. I don't know what that sound was. This is our fridge. We have some cream cheeses up there, some eggs, labna, milk, water, more pickles, carrots, these fruits. And this is bad, foodie. It just really shows how bad your eating has gotten. Wow. He said, remember how she ate when she would buy food? And Oh, yep. Yeah. There's no way they ate all of that. Well, that's why I guess somebody on Twitter was saying, do you think that the food was for, like, they gave some of it to his family or what? I know. Hey, surfer gal. Some veggies are still good. Some butter, some butcher, some eggs. Ketchup. Mustard, a thing of water, that's for the shisha. So as you can see, Hugh, I think she weighs probably close to 500 too. Big Smile said she's still eating takeout every day, so when would she have eaten it, right? Like the person on Twitter said, all but like three times they've had takeout, so what's going on? Broom there for decoration. Yeah, hey, Jen. Yeah. Separate, come on. Mm -mm -mm. I'm going to put the cord in here. Wait, now I have a question. Because, okay, so the corn, when it's cut up, is that when it's considered, what, how do you say, esquite? I'm probably saying that really wrong. Because I love that, but I love it too when they have it like off the, I don't really like to eat things on the cob. So like when I can get it all like chopped up into a cup, is that what it's, when it's called esquite? Like I really love that. Oh, I really want some right now. And why is Foodie drinking out of the pickle jar? <laughs> I used to do that when I was pregnant. Mm. Pickle juice? <coughs> Where it's at, man. Street corn. Yep. I could definitely go for some of that right now. All right. I'll be back when the corn is boiled. Maybe 15 minutes or so. Why did you say that weird in like about 15 minutes or so? Boil, boil, toil in trouble. Are you okay? Cody, are you okay? Still frozen. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Come on.
All right. Her breathing. Let that boil. It's smelling corny in here. Time to strain. It would be so much better if it was fresh. If it was fresh corn. One thing I do have that I bought, best thing ever. Grab the corn. I think it's ready. Now, we're gonna put some mayonnaise. Dude, her breathing. I know she is huffing and puffing, it's bad. And she says she's getting better. She sounds worse. Is she serious right now? Oh, here we go. Okay. Let's what the hell? Oh my gosh, it's so bad. Foodie, wake up. I don't like you, but you need to wake up. Brush is coming in handy as well. The corn is very hot, yes. <laughs> <clears throat> Borrow some of that mayo. Yeah, I think you need a lot more than that. She's going to kill this poor thing. I'm just going to coat the corn with some mayonnaise. My hands are clean, whether you believe that or not. I don't. Is up to you based on my track record, I guess. <laughs> I'm a changed woman, guys. All right, here we go. So that's probably still at the red room, PQ. Okay. You know what, you guys? This is like watching Eugenia. It's like the opposite end of the spectrum. But as we slowly see Eugenia Cooney fade away, it just reminds me of this, the huffing and the puff. She's literally gasping for air just standing there. That's scary to me. And Jen said those hands are huge and make everything look me true. She's nose breathing and mouth breathing. It, whatever she's doing, she needs help with it. So we have mayo, then we have some parmesan, like that. It's kind of messy though, isn't it? I think the parm helps the, <laughs> I think the mayo helps. I promise you it tastes really good and it looks much better than whatever she's attempting to do to this. <laughs> I promise you, it tastes so good. She's just ruining it. She does sound like a pug. She does. It's the parm a, a deer, you know? Jeez. All right. This is messy. Okay. Chili. Are we going to add any chili? A little bit of salt. A little bit of pepper. I mean, <laughs> should be a little. And some paprika. Paprika. <laughs> It's it's really concerning, Aaron. This isn't like it sounds worse than ever. Like she sounds like she's struggling to like get air. Now's a really good time, foodie, to check yourself in to inpatient somewhere and to ask for help. Is all this food really worth it? 
It's just temporary satisfaction. That's it. Is all of this really worth it? Okay, now turn that gently over. <laughs> I want to try authentic elote someday. All right, bit of pepper. Her hand. Bit of salt. Seven lives. Taste the biscuit. <laughs> with that song i don't even remember how the rest of it goes something about don't put your biscuit near my chicken wings or something <laughs> and a bit of paprika <laughs> all right I feel like we're going to see Bed Bound arc much sooner than we think if something doesn't change. I know, it's crazy. She's not even 40. Eee. Steffi said, Susan, step away from the paprika. <laughs> Lisa said she needs to borrow my mom's oxygen tank. She needs something. She needs a doctor. And there you have it. In Let's give it a try. It's hot. Mm. No, thank you. No, thank you to this. Mm. The corn is sweet. That's nice. Mm -mm -mm. I. <laughs> Mm -mm -mm. I can't. Booty, do you understand while you're moaning over that, that's what's unaliving you slowly? Yeah, it looks gross. It sounds gross. It's just the meat. Yeah. Ew. Ew. That's the best word. Ew. That's really good. I'm going to go share this with my husband. Oh, yeah, right. And then hopefully we can get some sleep with a belly full of corn. <laughs> Even though we have to be up in a few hours. With a belly full of corn. <laughs> First, whatever. Ta-da. Bye, guys. Bye. I hope you went to a hospital after this. I really hope you did. Yeah, that was um, a lot to take in. Uh, yeah, I, I don't think I want corn anytime soon now. <laughs> Jess said, if I ever caught my husband watching this, I'd be concerned as hell. Oh my gosh, I bet. Vicky said, sorry, butter, salt, and pepper for me or raw fresh picked. Mm, all four for her. Yeah, he didn't have any of that. There's not a chance. There's no way in heck he did. There is no way. Are right, you guys, I am going to, This. sorry, this is such a short stream today, but um, if you want to watch something entertaining, definitely go check out that YouTube live stream. We just did the TikTok. It's crazy. It's wild. Um, if Foodie Beauty uploads a vlog, video, mukbang, or anything like that, we will be back over here on Twitch today. If she does another TikTok live, we will cover it on YouTube. I want to thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. Thank you for sitting through hours of Foodie Beauty's BS with me. I really appreciate it. I know sometimes it's hard to watch, but um, you know, it's so much better and it's so much safer when we watch together. So I'm grateful for you guys and I want to thank you for all, all of your love and support lately. You guys have been just simply amazing. He's picky. She feeds him dino nuggies and chocolate. He is picky. <laughs> he reminds me of a little boy. Like just, I don't know. I don't know. They are an interesting fake couple. That's for sure. Hugh, if you had the choice between her cooking and nuggies, I'd go with nuggies. I'd starve. <laughs> I'd starve. All right, he love you. All right, you guys have a great day, great evening, wherever you are. And I have a feeling I will see you on some platform today very soon. Bye, you guys.